The steel sections databases. These first came available in release 2.0.1 of compact sections. There's uh, three uh, databases supported in this release. There's the AISC, or American. There's the United Kingdom standards and the European standards for steel sections. And there's classes of sections for I-beams and channels and angles. And you can see a description of those if you go to structuresoffice.com, documentation, steel sections databases. And let's, just, let's go take a look at that. So we got here again by going to the documentation, steel sections databases, and you'll see European shape database, and you'll see a description of each of the various classes for I-beam. Same for angles and U-profiles. British and AISC. For instance, W stands for wide flange beams, have parallel flange surfaces, S is a standard beam, having uh, sloped flanges, etc. So now let's go over and build a section. For instance, if you pick on a section, you see the database is up here in the upper left hand corner. Now if you pick on one, you see this dialog box up here. And there's two ways to go about it. If you know you, the section that you want, you click on this first di this first pull down and you go to the particular section that you're looking for and select it. You'll see the dimensions for that section appear here in the dialog box. Uh, you also see that it appear in the name. Down here you see the section properties for this section and you'll find that these are a little more conservative than what is actually computed from the, ge from the geometry of the section in the program. Another way to go about it is to p pick a particular section property that you're interested in. Say the uh, plastic section modulus, about the, uh, about the strong axis. And you see this range of values. That's for all I-beams. The strong axis plastic section modulus for all the I-beams in the European standard. If you then pick a range, say between 22.8 and 50, and then click Filter, then when you come up here, you'll see the list of those I-beams that match that range. And so here it's, this one is 23.22. And that's essentially it. If you have any problems with this or anything else, uh, contact support at structuresoffice.com and you can Request a remote session if you'd like, and we can work with you on your machine to help you out. Thanks for listening.